Hello, 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 and welcome back to N Raghav TV for yet another video. January transfer news. Not Barcelona this time. We talk about other clubs. Lot of deals happening and interesting deals happening as well. So let's get started. Let's kick off today's video with the first few deals which have been confirmed. Bruno Guimaraes, the Brazilian 24-year-old midfielder, does not join Arsenal. Yes, he does not join Arsenal. He was linked with Arsenal in the summer, in the January transfer window as well. But Arsenal, being Arsenal, have done it again. He goes to Newcastle for a fee of 40 million plus 8 millions in add-on, a contract till 2026. Really talented young player. Brazilian, he's got the flair. He's played in with Lyon in the Champions League. He has experience, and is he the player that is going to save Newcastle from relegation? Only time will tell. Talking about Arsenal targets, another deal has been confirmed, and that's Dusan Vla Vla Vlahovic. I'm not sure how we pronounce that. Dusan Va Vlahovic has joined Juventus. Arsenal miss out on yet another player. He was the top priority striker, the replacement for Aubameyang and Lacazette. He is signed for Juventus. Top deal of 70 million euros with 5 millions in add-on, 7 million in wages. He sets to join Juventus and a long list of players joining from Fiorentina to Juventus and. How is he going to help Max Allegri's side? It's only time will tell. And he is a top top striker. I love the way he plays. A good link up striker, left foot, right foot. I mean, he was a perfect suit for Arsenal. And you know, it's really tough that Arsenal have let the deal off. Now they're looking for other replacements. There's Jonathan David from Lille, and then there's. um the a real sociedad striker uh, isaac and let's wait and see what arsenal are going to do in the summer transfer window because looks like obamyang is on his way out and you know interesting times for arsenal because stock is staying on the topic of arsenal another departure has been confirmed callum chambers callum cafu chambers as arsenal fans famously referred to him as after that 3-3 draw performance against west ham he has joined aston villa and man what a window are aston villa having <clears throat> they've signed coutinho on loan they've gotten luka dinier then they've signed callum chambers as well now improving their squad depth this looking to sign bentancor from juventus as well i mean wow steven gerrard really 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 is building a really good side in aston villa and it's they going to be one of the teams to look out for not only for the rest of the season but in the upcoming seasons as well aston villa doing great business and showing ambition and talking about arsenal again one more player they've signed in finally it's not a defender it's not a striker or a midfielder arsenal have signed matt turner from new england revolution he is a goalkeeper he is the us men's national team starting goalkeeper and they've agreed for a fee of 7 million with plus 3 million in bonuses paperwork still going on but the deal has been confirmed so looks like burn leno on his, is on his way out aaron ramsdale number 1 for arsenal and matt turner most likely to be the backup option for arsenal so i mean one of the top deals of this january transfer window is liverpool stealing luis diaz fc porto player not many people might know about him but if you watched copa america you will definitely know about luis diaz fc porto winger he's rapid and if you look at his stats they are amazing and he's one of you know europe's elite young wingers and liverpool have got themselves a really really good deal 40 million 25 million in bonuses snapped up a deal again tottenham losing out on a player I mean it's nothing new so Liverpool already planning their future winger I mean it's a really really good deal 
the colombian winger joins liverpool last but not the least atletico madrid have confirmed the permanent move of daniel was the right wing back uh, the den uh, who plays for denmark 2.5 million medicals have been completed and it's now official they have also agreed personal terms with lils left back mandava few days ago so le- i mean january transfer window starting to heat up with the last few days left let me know your thoughts on these deals in the comment section down below and who do you think will succeed the most at the clubs that they're joining in and if you like the video do like share and subscribe to the channel and until next time see you soon with more january transfer news in the upcoming days thank you for watching the video and like share and subscribe